He's a Tiverton icon, famous across the globe, has more than 18,000 likes on Facebook and he brings a smile to the faces of Tesco shoppers. Ladies and gentlemen, this painting is of Tesco's cat, Mango. Ready? Yay! This week, the Mayor of Tiverton officially unveiled the work of art showing Mango, the much-loved Tesco cat, painted by Rob Martin, who is making a name for himself with his Moggy masterpieces. I painted a very well-known cat in Yorkshire called Felix, and uh, what happened was the cat, Felix the Huddersfield train station cat, it's, it's got a huge following in the north of England, or globally actually, like most cats. And whilst painting uh, Felix the Huddersfield train station cat, people uh, wrote to me on the internet saying, from here, from Devon, asking, have you painted our cat? Because usually, regarding the very first cat, the, the Huddersfield one, that was people saying, have you painted our cat yet? And so I painted Felix, and that's hung in Huddersfield train station. And it, it was, you know, a phenomenon on its own, own accord and what happened was I just thought why can't we repeat the thing so people were, were contacting me from Devon from, from down here as we'd say up north and uh, I thought who's this mango so you, you end up looking into what's this mango cat about and uh, I ended up painting a version which is, which is this uh, and hopefully you know it's another weird definitive uh, iconic cat painting the painting took three weeks to complete, with Rob working from photographs and paying a lot of attention to the lines and fur coloration to make it a unique and accurate piece of work. Because of the time and effort, the artist has slapped a clawsome price of £90,000 on the artwork. As, as ridiculous as it is, I've walked in some galleries in London and I thought, well, you know, I've seen paintings in London at three million a piece. And I just thought, well, yeah, it deserves to be. 90 grand, why not? Rob had originally been in touch with the Tiverton Porters group suggesting he create this work of art and it's hoped that people will travel from around to pause and gaze at this Mialvalis painting. Up until today I was, I was never really quite sure if it actually existed or whether it was just a huge a April Fool's joke but here it is and it's quite uh, unusual and interesting and uh, I'm hoping it'll bring a few extra people, well lots of people to Tiverton to come and see Mango the Tiverton cat looking glorious in his blue velvet, is it a smoking jacket? And he looks very posh, very smart. Yeah, it'd be a good idea, it'll draw the children, it'll give the, get the children yeah. one to come to mm, in and have a look, now, especially mm. right on holiday time. Mm. The kiddies around will, will want to come and see Mango the cat. Mm. Those outside Tiverton who don't know how important or revered Mango the Cat is, how, how would you um, sum up his fame in, in the town? Well, he, he had a bit of publicity, didn't he? He went, disappeared, went missing. Mm. Um, like most Tom cats, actually. Yeah, he, probably, yeah. he was probably up to no good somewhere. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so it, it's... Uh, but the, he's back, there's, the cat's back down at Tesco's. Um, we've got his portrait up here in the town. So. Mm. Forever immortalised, even more yeah. so than some of our mayors of Tiverton. <laughs> yes, Indeed, it is, yes. yes. Where's our portrait? <laughs> That's what I'd like to know. <laughs> yes. And it looks as though Tivertonians have welcomed it as the perfect addition to the town. It's really good. It's like really like artistic and shading's really good. It makes it look more lifelike. <laughs> it's a very unusual painting. I'm really interested to see it. Thank you very much for showing it to us. Uh, fascinating. We, we're just visiting Tiverton, so we didn't really expect to see that, but there we are. <laughs> it's cool. Different, but yeah, it's cool. <laughs> That's it. I'm done. Currently, the Portis team of Tiverton are looking for a permanent home for the portrait, so get in touch with them if you have any ideas on where to put it. In the meantime, it'll remain for all to enjoy at the Creative Hub in 4th Street. Lewis Clark. Devon Live, Tiverton.